Hello all, welcome to part 7 of Kubernetes Made Easy tutorial. In this session, I am going to explain one of the features of Kubernetes that is self-healing. So let's get started. How does Kubernetes perform self-healing? Kubernetes runs a process known as replication controller process, which monitors and heals the problematic nodes and containers. Now, let me show you one image. As part of self-healing, Kubernetes will take respective actions on the problematic nodes and containers. If Kubernetes finds a failed container, it will restart the container. If the Kubernetes finds a died node, it will reschedule the containers on this died node to other healthy nodes. If Kubernetes finds a container which doesn't respond to user-defined health check, in that case, Kubernetes will kill the container without impacting the application. So all these are the activities that are performed by Kubernetes as part of self-healing. So that's all for this session. See you in the next video session. Thank you. Bye.